going to a local barber shop means way more than just getting a haircut. Hi, I'm Crystal Nelson, and I am here to take you on a little journey today so that you can understand a little bit about the history of local barber shops and what it means to people who go there. Uh, I've been coming to this barber shop for about six months and started coming here because it was a recommendation from both a friend and a co-worker. Uh, we chose this barber shop because it is local, uh, it's very close to where we live and uh, we like to uh, support businesses that are close and both local. Uh, this barber shop um, has been my expectations because it is close by, it is local. Uh, they greet you when you come in, they ask if you want something to drink, whether it's water, soda, coffee, uh, even a beer if you would like. Uh, it's all complimentary and that goes a long way um, when it comes to being local and being friendly and, and uh, inviting. Why do I come to this barber shop and why do I want to keep coming back here? We moved down from Michigan about two years ago and my son-in-law came to Brett for a haircut. He recommended that I come over, so we came over and I got a haircut and I had never had a straight razor shave, so I thought I would give that a try. So since then I've been getting once a month a uh, haircut and a straight razor shave. <laughs> and the reason I do this is because it's relaxing for me. It's the one thing I do to pamper myself. My wife goes and gets her hair done, her nails done. Uh, on a monthly basis, so I figure I owe myself this, and this is a great place to go. They've got refreshments, you know, they've got the, I, I particularly like the old movies, the uh, Three Stooges, being an old timer. So th it's just a good place to come. It's relaxing, people are all friendly, uh, very accommodating. Uh, usually they don't have trouble getting an appointment, and uh, you know, what more I can say? This is a good place. Um, you ought to give it a try. I can recommend the straight razor shaves and uh, the haircuts. And since you're seeing this on video, I just I just finished with Brent and it looks, it looks pretty good to me. People have been going to barber shops for many different reasons. Throughout history, barbers started out as barber surgeons, which means they didn't only just cut off the ends of people's hair. Okay, barber history. Barber history dates back almost to the beginning of time, but particularly in the uh, it became really popular in the Egyptian era because style and image was everything to the Egyptians. So barbers were revered for many years as a pretty prestigious occupation. You held the image, the look of individuals in your hand. But also dating up until probably the early 1800s to the mid 1800s, barbers were, had dual occupations, sometimes three occupations. And primarily barbers were doctors or dentists or both. And a lot of people went to their barber for medical advice. And uh, around the 1600s, uh, monks used to also do what's called bloodletting and bloodletting is a process that was used to get rid of viruses or bacteria, sickness. It was thought to have get, to get rid of those things out of people's bodies. Bloodletting is what was used for many years, probably up until the mid to late 1800s before people realized that it really didn't work. They did a lot of amputations, they did a lot of surgeries and things of that nature. And what they would do with the bloody towels would hang them on a pole and the blood 
would drip down the pole, which gives us the barber pole of today. Every barber shop has its own special, unique qualities, and the employees bring their own special touch to the atmosphere. When I was a little boy, I think it was preteen, I saw my first horror film with my dad. It was Bela Lugosi and Dracula. And I was hooked from there on as horror films being my favorite genre of films. And I like the little character. I think the best thing I like about horror films is all the special effects they have when they create horror films and sci-fi films. And so I create my own special effects in the shop with all my decorations. Well, they, uh, well, some of the kids, and it's funny, you can't figure it out by looking at the kid, but some kids love them and other kids run away screaming. Barber shops are not just for men. They're for women and children as well. Because, uh, first of all, I would like to make people more happy about themselves, about their look. I want to give them a you know, different kind of view of themselves, because sometimes people come in you know, with a particular style years and years, and then you offer something else, and people see themselves completely different and complete. Um, I think the most fun thing about my job is um, enjoying each client that comes in and um, building a relationship with them and getting to know them and watching their children grow when they bring their kids in and um, just being a part of their life. But um, I think another thing too is just the people that I work with. People are, are a lot of fun and um, make it a fun place to work. Well, other than being the best, we, uh, we're, we're trying very uh, earnestly to make it unique and different. We have a couple of separate rooms. We have a, an area where there's four barbers all together. We have a nice waiting room. Ah, sometimes when I'm tired, the, 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 uh, re, the scheduled breaks help me get through the day. But when I'm not so tired, you know, the conversation and, you know, and clowning around with people and drinking coffee and stuff like that. Uh, the types of clients uh, that we have come in are uh, anywhere from young babies, I've had maybe five, six months with long hair, all the way up to um, clients, gentlemen in their maybe 80s or so. Um, we have a range of clients who come in from people who don't get their hair cut, but maybe every three, four, or five months to um, people who come in every two weeks, so from businessmen to um, people who have a just very uh, relaxed lifestyle who um, just need their hair touched up every now and then. Most of men and the children, I'm not yet a lot working with the women, but I'm looking forward to it. And what gets me through the days, um, I, I really enjoy my job, I love what I do. I like the interaction between people, um, the clients and my coworkers. Yeah, coffee definitely helps <laughs> in the morning. But I just love what I do, and it's, it's my passion for my job and my career that gets me through my day. Barber shops are for relaxation and socialization and most of all, a great haircut. Maybe next time when you see a local barber shop, you'll stick your head in and take a look because local barber shops are way more than just a haircut.